evaluation of a book. No, no I don't but I know you say you just come to this, but I mean, when people heard from the outside, you've got plenty of tweets and responses that Lovey Smith or the Buccaneers would consider Gene Cousins based on his history of last year, which is well documented. And it, it, it's not just about racist comments or homophobic comments, but also sexual, uh, you know, assault type, type situations. That they would be a little, you know, surprised would be the word, I guess. You say accusations, has he been, one more time. Well, right? well again, Ac I'm talking about again, talking there, about was, there was a report by the NFL which documented and investigated the, the accusations and found many of them to be very true. Many of and them, see there's a lot of, many of them, and it's been documented by others. Well, the league, the league documented it. Well, just let me finish, yeah. all right? But for me, I would like to talk to him myself. And if you know my history, I do believe in second chances. And to me, nobody should have a death sentence. If you if you should, you're probably in jail. And then from there, what does it hurt to talk to someone? So for me, if we go forward, I'm not holier than now. I'm going to give everybody the benefit of the doubt until I have information that tells me about that. And that's where we're at right now. Love you. Part of that process is Richard coming in. But you said that um, everybody's on board with that 53. Did that include even going to a player like Gerald McCord or maybe some of the leaders or captains and talking to them before a decision like this is made? Before we bring in anyone that would possibly be considered a uh, controversial, yes, I would consult our team leader. It's a part of the process also. Favorite one is here. That's been, they've been pretty much a part of the process. Everywhere I've been, the players have been a part of the process. It's just not me making decisions by myself. I consult a lot of people. But a part of the process, as you look at anyone, is a face-to-face. -face. 